name Tim Goorstein. I'm the chef of uh, Bukonville restaurant in uh, uh, Hotel 27, uh, located in Amsterdam, in the heart of Amsterdam, uh, on the town square. So the dish I'm going to make is uh, brill fillet. I'm going to make a, a rouleau, a classic roll, uh, filled uh, with gamba roja. Uh, we're going to use everything from the gamba roja, so we're making a farce from the tails. The heads we're uh, pan frying and we're making oil are using in the in the sauce and on the side we are making some gnocchis with the anchovies and some asparagus. So 10 years ago um, when I was a rookie in the kitchen uh, you were really looking up to the chef and people still do. Yeah. It's difficult to explain but there's a, a, a type of, of, of culture in the kitchen where nobody dares to say something to the chef. Um, for me it was an eye-opener and I was like okay if I become a chef later I want to be a little bit different more open, more approachable. I want to be really part of the team, not only standing above them and uh, look at me and the chef, no, not at all. Um, we have to do everything together, I can't do it alone. Um, it's not that back in the days uh, it was only like that, but there was a certain distance uh, where you yeah, were a little bit afraid or um, uh, you didn't uh, dare to be creative or do your own thing. And I want to be the chef that people don't only look up to but also can relate and they can be open and be their self and uh, enjoy their work and going to work because we already we all know we're making long hours long days and that we, we enjoy what we do this is, this is the most important message for me as being one of the next generation chefs um, yeah just uh, support the new the, the new and the next generation after us Also, what's a really big difference is that ten years ago, when I was uh, when I was young, the chef didn't go out of the kitchen. He didn't go to the guests. You could only hear, yeah, compliments table ten, and they were satisfied by that. And I was like, eh, I'm cooking for the guests. I want to see the guests. I want to talk with them. And um, I've learned that, of course. And go, I'm, I'm a social person, so for me it was more easy to do. But I love to go into the restaurant, have a chat with the guests. Um, interact with them, getting feedback uh, about how their experience was. In the end of the day, I'm cooking for my guests and this is the most important for me and to be satisfied and when I'm back at the, on the motorbike driving back home thinking about it and uh, how guests were happy, uh, yeah, this is what I'm doing it for, this is my job.